Hi, welcome to Blind Owl Bushcraft and Survival. Today what I'm going to do is I'm making a, a bamboo cane and the reason I'm making a cane is I have to go to the city tomorrow with my family and I'm in the Philippines and I'm going to be going to Cebu City which is a pretty nasty place and I don't feel comfortable without taking some sort of a weapon with me and I can't really take a knife or a machete or something like I'd like to take with me and make me feel much better because all the boats now have metal detectors on them and stuff so what I'm, I'm just going to take a cane with me and I'm going to put a wrap around the handle and for that I'm just going to tie a clove hitch just like that tuck it right underneath there just like that very simply and pull it as tight as I can looking for about a six inch handle to just make it look nice and then what I'm making is a, a spiral wrap so all you do is this it's just going to be repeated half hitches so all you're going to do is just make a, a loop in the in the cord pull it as tight as you can and then pull the knot up and then what you want to do is you want to make sure all your your loops are tight do the same thing again just make a loop and slide it over the top pulling it tight as tight as you can and then pull it up push your loops tight again now I'm not using a specific length of rope I just have a big long length here and I'm just going to just keep going until I finish it so I just loop it half hitch slide it down pull it tight and then pull it up and every time just make sure you slide them together make them look real nice loop pull it tight As you can see it's starting to make a nice little spir spiral around there. What I'll do now is I'll, I'll get back to you when I get up towards the end. Okay, I've got it wrapped tight up to the top of the stick here. About as, about as far as I can get it. So what I'm going to do is to finish it off, you can do one of two things. You can tie a cross knot on here and make a like a little lanyard loop on here if you want to. I don't really care for that. Uh, what I'm just going to do is I'm just going to cut this off about uh, a little over a quarter inch maybe. And then I'm just going to burn it in. I'm going to get it real molten. And then just press it in with my butter knife thing. And as you can see, that makes a just a beautiful bond. And I'll do the same thing with the clove hitch end. Cut that off at about a quarter inch also. And if you, if you burn it in like this, this won't allow it to untwist at all. If you don't, sometimes with some different ropes, if you twist the, the grip a little bit, it will loosen up a little bit. But it won't, it won't this way. So it is real molten. I made it just a little bit too long.
press it in with the knife. That one didn't bond quite quite like I'd like it to. Get a little more bubbly. And just press her on in. And as you can see, it winds up with a pretty nice spiral grip. Um, personally, I would use a little bit thinner cord. So this is all I had right now. Um, it's kind of a polyester cord, almost like a clothesline uh, cord, something like that. But this will work for what I'm going to use it for. Uh, I might, I might even redo it and make it with a. Uh, paracord wrap or something like that but this, this this looks pretty good well that's all I have for you right now that's a, that's a spiral wrap Thank mm -hmm. you.